Hello everyone and welcome back to Glorious Events channel where we talk about everything events related. So today we are going to talk about why girls say no to a marriage proposal. Yes, I think you've all seen the video. If you've not seen it, here it is. Say So just like in this video, the girl said no or rejected that particular marriage proposal. And we just want to delve into the reasons why girls would say no to a marriage proposal. Because this is causing a lot of anxiety, a lot of fear in the young men. So I don't want it to be something that will discourage men into doing that they will now start shying away from proposing but let's at least look at the reasons why your girl would say no to your marriage proposal so that you address these things before so that when it reaches that time she just says yes so the first thing that will make a girl say no to a marriage proposal is the love language you have used I'll give an example if your girl is an introvert hmm? She's an introvert, she likes her privacy, she likes her things done with very close loved ones. And for you, you go out there and book a whole restaurant or hotel or something and bring so many people, bring her workmates, bring her friends, bring her family, bring everyone and then she walks in maybe you've told her you're going for a dinner date with her and she has come you know relaxed and knowing it's just the two of you having dinner and then she walks in and the whole room is full of people and you propose to her she will cringe she will cringe under her skin because it's just not the thing for her for her it's a special moment between the two of you she's that intimate she's an introvert so study your partner very well and know what works for them so that you do what what will, will be comfortable for them what they will appreciate what they will enjoy and if the opposite is also true if someone is an extrovert if someone is an extrovert and you just you know take her like to dinner and you're on the table eating and you're like will you marry me she might just be like no <laughs> like do better like she wants the whole pomp and flare and balloons and what what maybe that's her thing that's her love love because she's an extrovert so just study your partner and get to actually know those things that please them so that when you do it you're doing it in the confines of what works for her what she feels very comfortable in the other thing that would make a girl say no to your marriage proposal is that she is not ready the pressure pressure either peer pressure from her age mates or her friends or pressure from the family from aunties from her mother from just uh, female people in her life 
telling her you know you you're delaying you need to get married oh your your friends are already married your sisters are already married are you waiting for that pressure can be so much on a girl and by the time you you propose yes maybe she's in the relationship with you but she's just not there yet she's not ready <laughs> but because of pressure maybe for you you already talk to the mother you already talk to your friends with the sisters and what and you feel like because they like you and they want her to get married to you hey she's ready she's ready ah study her ask her questions about marriage about her future plans about weddings about pick pick her mind and get to know if she is still you know thinking about it or if you ask her about the wedding and she already is giving you <laughs> tips of her hands oh i'd like my wedding to be like this i like this i like this you know she's more ready for that step but if you ask her things to do with settling down uh, for starting a family lot and she's like no uh, this year i just want to focus on my studies i want to finish my course i want to do this like she's not yet there and then you push it and you just pop the question you might need, you might get a no. the reason why she would say no is the timing get your timing right get your timing right just like i said in the previous um explanation sometimes she's just not ready it's not the time maybe she's so busy with studies or she's so busy with the particular project or like her work her career is taking off so quickly and she's so engrossed in that and she just she, her head space is just not here in marriage and settling down and all that so get your timing right try to find the right time the other reason she might say no is because she just thinks you're not the one yes even when you have been dating for some time someone might might still deep in their gut you know ladies we have the sixth sense deep inside she will just know and no this is not the man for me in the fairy tales they say you kiss many frogs before you find your prince charming so to her you might be one of those frogs <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry but you get my point like she she might not look at you as the father of her children as the person she's going to live with for the rest of her life because maybe of things that have been happening in your relationship that have made her doubt if you're actually the man for her dreams for example maybe you both clash a lot you fight a lot about everything maybe um the communication is off in the relationship maybe you just had an argument the other week and now you're popping the question and she's looking at you like uh i'm not really sure i want to settle with this person you get yeah so you to her you might not really be the ideal person and she might just say no because no she doesn't see you as the ideal person you have to prove that you're the ideal person for her the other problem that i have just come into realizing these days is that some people just don't believe in marriage it's a, it's, it's sad but it's happening and it's not because of their own choice sometimes it's because of their background yes their background maybe things happened maybe they were in a in a, a divorced family maybe they saw their parents getting separated getting divorced and it affected them and they just lost that that belief that marriage works or maybe they were in an abusive um family like where there was abuse and they would see maybe their mother getting beaten and they just lost that excitement of getting into such a relationship so people have gone through different things and some people just don't believe in marriage like they 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 can even be the best girlfriend the best girlfriend they are there within the relationship but the day you start bringing up topics of marriage or marriage proposals and all that they just freeze like they, they don't want to go that other side because they've seen that side in in their upbringing and it was not really a good example for them to look up to so you might want to maybe know more about your partner's background uh their upbringing their um, parents are they together they divorced how did that affect her or just things that might sway her from believing that 
this is the best decision for you and her. Those are my top five reasons why a girl would say no to a marriage proposal. If you know any other reasons, maybe it has happened to you, maybe you witnessed it somewhere, please share it in the comments below and tell us what made that, that friend of yours or that sister of yours or that particular girl to say no to that marriage proposal so that our brothers can learn from this so that when it's their time to do it they don't get no for an answer it's very disappointing it's very discouraging for a man to be turned down by someone they consider the love of their life that they are, they are going the extra step to propose to them so we don't want this to keep happening we want to help our brothers get to that place where they will propose and get yes for an answer and we get to plan a wedding because glorious events is here to help you plan your weddings and we'll not have weddings to plan if you all keep saying no <laughs> so till next time for more videos about events pre-event during the event and post event let's discuss everything events related till next time Bye for now. God bless you.